If you are in Australia and you want to do some GPS surveying, then you need the house Jewett. But what is the house Jewett? To answer that question, we need to know how GPS coordinates are given. They are given in latitude, longitude and orthometric height. The latitude and longitude can easily be transformed to a northing and an easting. But the orthometric height is a bit more difficult to change that to the Australian height datum. When you have a GPS coordinate, then you can only calculate the height to the Australian height datum with a Jewett. That is why you need the Aus Jewett. But then there's Aus Jewett 09 and Aus Jewett 2020. But what is the difference and when you use which Aus Jewett? In Australia, they use two ellipsoids. The first one is G D A 94. The second one is G D A 2020. They both use WGS84. But there is a difference between this one and this one. And that is the epoch that is used of the WGS84. The GDA94 is using the epoch of 1984. And the GDA 2020 is using the epoch of 2010. And there is a difference between those two. You have to know that the surface of the Earth is moving over the Earth. So a position in 2010 is different of the GPS position of 1984. That also means that you need to use another GWIT file. So in Australia, when you use GGA94, then you need to use the AUS GWIT09. And when you use GGA2020, you need to use AUS GWIT. 2020. Let's see how you use AUS Jewett 2020 in Ablos Survey Wizard. So let's start to configure Ablos Survey Wizard, the easy to use land survey app. And we want to configure it in this way that we can use AUS Jewett 2020. The first thing what we do is to go to the files menu and then we click on other settings. So we want to change the country next to the flag. So we're looking for Australia and there are different territories in Australia and you have to pick the one that you want to choose. So for now I click on Tasmania and then you can select the ellipsoid. As I told you before, we want to use GDA 2020 because that one is using Aus 2020. And then you can select any coordinate reference system that uses AUS Jewett 2020. When you selected the correct coordinate reference system, then you can click on the cloud icon. And that is only there when you didn't download the Jewett file. So I click on it, then it will download. And now it's downloaded, so I can click the OK button. And now Ablo Survey Wizard is configured so that you can do GPS surveying with Aus 2020 in Australia. Check out this video on what you should not forget when you want to start to land survey with the Amlet Reach RS2.